So being able to change app icons on your iPhone or iPad is a really cool way to customize your home screen. It just makes your iOS device feel more the way you want it to. So we're going to show you how to do this on iOS 16. Now, if you've never done this before, it's really fun. It can get a little bit addictive, so be warned. You're also going to need a third-party app called Shortcuts, which is free to download. Now, once you download it, which shouldn't take long, it's going to have a blank screen like this. And what you want to do is tap the plus icon in the top right-hand corner. Now, as soon as you do that, you're going to see an option in the middle that says Add Action. And what we want to do at this point is type in Open App. And this is basically the action we're going to set. After you do that, there's going to be an, a selection for an app. I'm going to go with Instagram for this example. Okay, after you do that, you want to hit the little squiggly in the top right here. And then you want to click Add to Home Screen. Now, this is very important, so stick with me. We want to name the app Instagram because that's what's going to be our app icon that we're, you know, setting an automation with. And you have to have some, you know, pictures or logo pictures, uh, you know, for Instagram. I've got a cool one right here. I mean, how slick does that look, right? Okay, so when you've got everything set, just click Add, and it's going to add it to your home screen, and boom, it's right there. Now, when we tap on this app icon, you can see there's a little notification that comes up, which is just an automation letting uh, you know the Shortcuts app allow you to open up Instagram. So I'm going to do another example because I know I did that one a little bit fast. I'm going to use Robinhood as my second example here. So we're going to do this again. Hit the plus icon, type in Open App. Okay, after we select the action, we need to select the app, which I said is going to be Robinhood. Then we need to hit the squiggly in the top, click Add to Home Screen. We need to name it Robinhood. And then we got to set a picture for it. I've already got a pretty cool one. It's like a Robinhood crypto logo. And there it is. Pretty sweet, right? Now, like I said, you could do this for every single app you have on your iPhone, which is just going to allow you to, you know, customize the look of your home screen. I'd also recommend checking out a Yoshi wallpaper. Uh, I'm sure you guys like the look of this Yoshi wallpaper I got right now. I think it looks pretty slick. Okay, anyways, uh, just a quick tip for you. Um, hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching this, and we'll see you guys in the next video.